Today you will learn how to overcome the I need to talk to my spouse objection. When a client says I have to talk to my spouse, what do you say? Do you pitch them on why they should buy from you now? Or do you let them talk to their spouse and never call you back? There is a way to turn this objection into a commitment and possibly a sale. In this video you can watch master sales coach Nicole Kramer handle the objection I have to talk to my spouse. My name is Robin and welcome back to my channel. I help nutrition coaches finally build the confidence to transform the health and lives of others, allowing them to build a successful nutrition coaching business. If you want to see more videos like this, make sure that you subscribe and like this video. Let's jump into the conversation. Hi Robin, how are you? I'm feeling really good and I'm excited to have this conversation. Good. I'm excited to have it too. I appreciate you making some time for this. I know um, we've chatted a little bit in the past and you've been interested in my program and I am happy to be able to be here and have the conversation with you and answer any questions you might have. Um, I also want to give you a chance to share with me, you know, what, what you're looking to do and, and create um, during our time together. How does that sound? Sounds really good. So here's the thing. I have, um, friends of us um, marry um, towards the end of the year. And I know my suit doesn't fit as good anymore. Mm -hmm. My wife says it looks really, really bad. So um, something has to change. Mm -hmm. And I'm, I'm curious about what, does, what are we going to do in these three months? And um, yeah, what, what's, the, what's the investment? So it sounds like you've got another person a little bit interested in you making a decision here. Yeah, um, <laughs> she, she wants to have me in a little bit better shape for sure. She has okay. mentioned it more than once. Okay. How is she supportive of you uh, making these changes then? Um, she's supportive of me losing weight. Um, she really thinks, uh, do you really need a coach? Because mm -hmm. they're just, they want so much money and you can just eat less or do some of these programs. She downloaded an app to my, to my cell phone, but, um, yeah, so she is, uh, she wants that I, that I do something, but she is weary of, do we really need a coach? How does she feel about you being on this call? Um, she had this whatever look and didn't, didn't mention, didn't, didn't say anything more. No. So I'm curious, we're going to discuss the program. You're clearly interested in, you know, what, what I offer and you've been drawn to this conversation for a reason. If you decide today that you are ready to jump into this, how do you think she will feel about that? So she will have this, this attitude of, uh, do you really need do you really need to spend so much money? Mm -hmm. um, because she always looks like, oh, we could do a nice vacation, or we could do this or that. So she she looks after the money a lot more. Mm -hmm. um, but it's also if I say I want to do this, she won't talk me out of it. Okay. So it sounds like you don't need her permission. You'll be looking for her support in you joining this program. That would make things a lot easier when she says, yeah, good decision instead of what have you done? Mm -hmm. Awesome. So let's find out if this is the decision that you want to make. Um, 
because I'm also very clear, you might have some questions. You might want to review some things with me Mm -hmm. before you get to that point of knowing if this is right for you. So tell me, what can I share with you? What can I answer for you to help you understand if this is the right decision for you? Okay. Um, So maybe let's start with the actual program. What is in it Mm -hmm. um, that really distinguishes you from the app on my phone? Mm-hmm. Good question. Well, first of all, how has the app on your phone been working for you? I have it on my phone. <laughs> so, so that's probably one of the first uh, differentiating factors. Um, I'm a I'm a live person, and I'm going to be waiting for you on our mm-hmm. sessions together. Versus you just being able to swipe and get rid of that notification on your app. Um, I had this conversation a couple of times. What's you, that? You know people who are swiping the notifications. So I heard that story before. I've heard that song and dance, Robin. <laughs> because here's the thing: the app is a great solution until, and and there's nothing wrong with the app, right? Google has some great information. YouTube has some great trainings. There's all kinds of information out there. What we need to figure out is why is it not working for us if it's not working? And I find that a lot of times when there's not a person on the other end of it, um, it's a little bit easier to not hold yourself accountable because nobody really knows that you swiped and and said, forget it to the app. Um, What kind of results are you really looking to create during our work together? So I've, I've got into this habit of relaxing on the couch and eating more and more regularly ice cream and it just it sits in all the good places it stays and with you <laughs> it, yeah i it really shows how much ice cream i've been eating so um i really i want to lose the the belly and maybe so the pants are not as tight so there's maybe even a little dessert for me at the wedding there's enough space in in the pants um, and overall, just getting out of this rut every evening, finishing finishing the evening on something sweet, because this is just, I can't do this. That's not okay. Mm-hmm. So you kind of have gotten to a point where you're ready for some change. You're ready for some things to be different. And you're looking for a program to help support you with that. Yeah. Okay. And at the end of our three months together, what type of, how will you know that the program has been successful for you? So first of all, um, I feel a lot more comfortable in my suit. Mm -hmm. And maybe even getting a compliment from my wife, how good I'm looking in my suit. So if she's, ooh, you, then it's. It has been all worth it. (laughs) (laughs) So you want a little bit of room in that suit so you can eat dessert at the wedding. Yeah. You want to feel good in that suit so you can dance at the wedding. And you want to get some really fun compliments from your wife so that you feel good in that suit at the wedding. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Well, those are things that we can certainly uh, focus on during our time together and definitely accomplish as long as you show up powerfully and and you're ready to go. And it sounds like you are. Yeah, so I I will have to make a strong case why I spend so much money on a coach. Mm -hmm. But um, I think if we can really get going with the program and I actually just throw all the ice cream away, Mm -hmm. um, the, the questionable decision will be very soon like oh that was a great decision um there's two things i want to redirect you to first of all you might not even need to throw all the ice cream away and that could still be a part of what you enjoy during your day oh you know how to talk to me there you go (laughs) Food, food speaks right i uh i don't like restriction so that's not really a part of my programs um and also something else that i want you to think about differently I don't want you to think of this as spending money and I don't want you to think of it as spending it on me. Mm -hmm. This is an investment in you. This is an investment in 
how you feel about yourself and creating these results so that you really feel good about how you approach life every day and knowing you get to eat ice cream as a part of your day as well. Mm -hmm. And so I want you to see this as what's possible for you. What's possible for Robin because of making this investment. It's not just an investment in money. This is an investment in your time. This is an investment in your focus. This is an investment in you becoming this version of you that you're looking to become. That's going to be dancing in that suit, feeling really good in your body and enjoying life in a new way. You, when, when you're talking about me dancing in my suit, um, I'm sorry, I know it sounds, it sounds childish, but I see a red cape flying around behind me like this. Ooh, look at me, what I've done. In my age, yeah. I still, woo, and I yeah. look so good for this wedding, and my wife is constantly touching me, so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. and you're probably eating some ice cream while all that's going on, too. Yeah, they are always, how can you be in this shape and still eat ice cream? Mm. How does all I'm, that feel? I'm really like? looking forward to our, uh, to our work together. Yeah, it sounds like you've made a decision. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Excellent. So here's how this will work. We're going to set up your first appointment right now. And we're going to complete the payment right now. And then I'll have my assistant send the contract and all the information out to you so that we can get started. And uh, I'm excited that you are ready to do this work and that you are ready to be dancing, flying high at that wedding with your red cape feeling good, getting the compliments from your wife, eating the ice cream, and just feeling good about what you've done for yourself by making this decision. Oh, I'm really looking forward to finally getting this under control. So the secret to the I need to talk to my spouse objection is to handle it before it handles you. The call removed the objection early on by exploring how a support of their spouse is of their decision. If you learned something today, make sure that you give Nicole a follow. She has an amazing Facebook group with tons and tons of free content around sales and how to build your coaching business. She also has a free download of 30 free places to find new clients. Both links are in the description below. Also, if you want to see more objection role plays like this, make sure that you leave a follow so to let us know. And if you want to dive deeper, I have added two videos at the end of this video. One is a longer discovery call conversation so you can really see the process of the conversation and how to create the gap. And the other is a video on a very simple discovery call script, especially for new coaches.